Okay, is the St. James Palace Fox Hunters Chase Race 29 here at day three of Cheltenham. Still not had a winner. Quite disappointed myself. But this is a three mile, two and a half furlong, 0 to 100 to handicap. So number one, Lord Babushka for Martin, leading the 10 to 3 favourite, 100 to 30. Sphinx Walks in for Darren House is two. Kubla Khan for Molly at Surfer is three. Admiral Bing for Graham Quattapuck is four. Cuisine for Carl Aragante is five. De Angelis for James Follis is six. Little Istanbul for Carl Aragante is seven. According to the boss, Darren House is eight. Some Lady Alex Cherry is nine. Half Hour Hancock for Stu Gray is ten. Dells Goes for Del Henson is eleven. Fifth Manager Alex Cherry is twelve. Juwala Makalev for Doug Warren is thirteen. An Outlaw Torn number. 14 for Obi Wan makes up the last one to go over three miles, two and a half furlongs. And the St. James Palace Fox Hunters chase flying around the course here. As I said before, how do they even know where they're going? They don't even know where they're going to start on this course. Look, there's more rows here than the British row, and they're away finally. And they're straight into the first. Everybody gets over it, but a really poor jump by the grey in the mid-pack there, Jawal and Maclet. Uh, Doug, he's going to have to jump better than that if you want to get round. So it's Cuisine and Little Istanbul and Outlaw Torn. Take us along. Let's throw it together and head down to the second of the 21. About three lengths ahead of the rest of the pack. Which are across the course. Just a surface horse. When he gets to the second, the leaders are over it. As does the rest. It's Cuisine and loses by a length into the third. The leaders are over it. We'll come down to the fourth. So it's Cuisine, Little Istanbul, and Outlaw Tour. Swing left hand and start to go out. First of two circuits. It's Cuisine from Outlaw Tour and Little Istanbul. Then four back to Sphinx, Walton, and Jawal and Maclet the Great. Get to the fourth. Everybody's over it. So the first five are in Indian file. Just behind uh, Jawala Maclet by about a length is Molly at Surfers Kubla Khan against the fence. And then we've got De Angelis, Some Lady, and Fifth Marriage. And Babushka just nosing in there, as well as Half Hour Hancock. And the shooting Dells goes out, we'll bring a call to the boss. Oh, we've lost one there. Some Lady's gone for Alex Cherry. Didn't get to see it. Need to pan a little bit wider here. But it's Cuisine and Outlaw Tour now. Into the water. Should I say over the water? Everybody's over. And there's already 20 lengths between first and last. Been through just roughly a mile. And it's cuisine and outlaw torn. Oh, and we've lost another there. Sphinx walking and gone. Oh, and oh no, maybe not. I thought uh, that was Sphinx walking lying on the floor for Darren House. Bad luck. We get to the eighth. The leaders are over it this time. As is the remainder. Called to the boss and starting to lose a little bit here. But it's Cuisine from Outlaw Torn and Little Istanbul. Five back to Jawala Makalet to Angelus and Kubla Khan. And then Lord Babushka, the top weight, fifth marriage, the grey half hour Hancock. And the two at the rear, Dells Ghost, and according to the boss, we'll jump the ninth. And it's as we were, and there's according to the boss, he's still plugging on. See, the boss has told him you must get round. Down to two miles left to travel. Down to the tenth. It's Cuisine that's going to lead them over it. Leaders jump it well. Oh, what a poor jump there by half hour. Hancock the grey towards the rear. Still got a loose horse there. I'm assuming, according to the boss, is still running. And again, further and further apart now. 30 lengths, well, even further because we can't see according to the boss. But well, dragged out again, once again, here. The National Hunt this year. I know I might well have uh, been moaning, but you know me, I like to have a bit of a moan. I think the front runners have uh, certainly caused a problem with the pull ups of the National Hunt this year. More front runners than we've ever had. And they've certainly, uh, I think, uh, my personal opinion. Oh, and we've lost another one there. Fifth marriage has gone. Alex Cherry's second horse falls. Bad luck, Alex. Alex, you can turn off now. And there's a call to the boss at the rear still. No, I'm thinking a lot of the pull-ups have been caused by all these front runners that we've had in the National Hunt this year. And I think probably because there's... You're allowed two. So what actually happens is if you've got two front-running horses, they take each other on. And 
since they dragged the field out even more, but it doesn't really matter. That's the final SO6. Who really cares, eh? Anyway, it's Cuisine that leads from Outlaw Torn and Little Istanbul, then five back to De Angelis, then a further three back to Lord Babushka and Kubla Khan, and then a couple of greys, half hour Hancock and Joala Nakalet, Dell's Dell's Ghost, and Admiral Brink, and according to the boss, is still there. We think they take the 15 of the water. Excuse me. That's Cuisine from Little Istanbul and Outlaw Torn. Dangerous on his own, Lord Babushka, Kubla Khan, Joala Makalet, and Half Hour Hancock. A small ditch there. Dell's Ghost Admiral Bing, and according to the boss, we're hoping still running. We just can't. Oh, we lost one of the leaders. Cuisine's gone. Didn't even try to get up over that fence. Bad luck there, Carl. Lucky you've got Little Istanbul still plugging away. But now led by Outlaw Taunt. Inside the seven furlongs, it's Outlaw Torn from Little Istanbul. Four back to De Angelis and Lord Babushka. And about another five to half hour Hancock under a lot of pressure. Kubla Khan and Dell's Ghost travelling quite well. Joala Mount, oh, we lost another. Another one's gone there, Admiral Bing. And there is, according to the boss, he's still there. So unlucky for Admiral Bing. I'm not sure whose white silks they are. But, uh, you're out of the race. It's Little Istanbul that finally takes it up inside the fight. So Little Istanbul from Outlaw Torn. Lord Babushka running well now. Dell's Ghost and De Angelis. These are about seven to eight lengths away from Kubla Khan. And a further three or four back to Juwala Makalet and Half Air Hancock. And a call to the boss we can't see. And they're not going to win from there. So we're inside the four in the final half. It's Little Istanbul and Dell's Ghost. These are one and two. Lord Babushka, the top weight, running well. Outlaw Torn's under a little bit of pressure now. De Angelis seems to be losing ground. So three furlongs to home. It's Dell's Ghost. A couple to jump. Little Istanbul in second. Lord Babushka out. Lord Torn. Dell's Ghost is going to lead them into the penultimate. Well, it's Dell's Ghost by about three. Lord Babushka running on. Little Istanbul's running out a little bit of steam now. Lord Torn still plugging away. De Angelis is trying to make up some ground. So inside two furlongs now they get over the 20th. Dell's Ghost, but Lord Babushka jumped it faster. Dell's Ghost from Lord Babushka running on well. He's out. Lord Torn. He's over the last Dell's Ghost. So within a furlong for home. Up the hill now. It's Dell's Ghost by about three to Lord Babushka. Babushka Outlaw Torn running on really well, but they're not going to catch this leader. It's going to be a win for Dale Hinton here. Hollywood takes the St. James's Place Fox Hunter chase. We're running him down, but he's got it in the bag. Dale's Ghost takes it from Lord Babushka in second. Outlaw Torn is third. Little Istanbul is four. DeAngelis, I think, going up in fifth. Cooper Carl is six. Half Air is seven. Jawala Makara at eight. Come on, according to the boss. We didn't get to see him, but he finished. No pull ups in that race. So a win for Dell, well done. Second was Lord Babushka for Martin Liedem. Third was Outlaw Torn for Obi-Wan. Fourth was Little Istanbul for Kyra Aganti. And fifth was De Angelis for James Follis.